Right, this is Sir Loxton Church. Um, I haven't got my glass. Forgot my glasses again. Um, just doing a video. where the bells are rung in here. I nearly wasn't going to do another church because I felt so tired. So I had to traipse all around the countryside a minute ago finding Kingston St Mary and came across Broomfield and did that church. So I'm now in this one. I thought I'd like to do three churches in a day. I always feel like I've achieved. I've got to do the video early there, just in case that man doing the cutting the lawn um, decides to lock the church up. It's much simpler than the others I've been to this morning. To the memory of Eliza Sarah Harrison of Thurloxton, who died March the 18th, 1876, aged 55. Now oh, look at that little step there. Step up there to get up onto the pulpit, look. Diamond Jubilee. 1952 to 2012, that was the year I was born, 1952. It's a window dedicated to that, Queen Elizabeth. More puritanical looking. Some nice old pillars though. The pews look pretty old as well, actually. And a good old font. Hardly noticed it. Have a closer look at that in a minute. Have a nice little lid on it. I always come up into the This area because you can get a better view. Pulpit. Yes, better, better view. Look at the altar, very simple compared to the Redos. It's got a little uh, thing there. I'm, I'm forgetting the terms um, for putting, getting the holy water and everything. And it's got a quite a nice little stained glass window. It's nothing fancy. <sighs> They're into the Queen here. They've got um, Victoria there, look. 1897. 60 years of being a Queen. And then over there we've got June the 20th. So 60, no, I don't sure. <sighs> like a wagon type ceiling. Simple. It could have been a lot more decorated at one time. <sighs> it smells old though. Something tells me it's old. What I'll have to do is put a postscript and a little bit of information about the church. I've left the glasses in the... Uh, so I can't read none of that. Look, I'll magnify it. The font is the most ancient of our possessions. It is of the Saxon or very early Norman period and is not later than a year to 1100 AD. So for 900 years, 
At least so Loxon's children have been baptised at this font. It is a wonderful thought. I thought it felt this ancient parish stocks are to be found under the old yew tree in the centre of the churchyard. Oh, that's all right then. So I thought that font, I thought that font looked old. It's because it's a big plump thing. I'm, I'm almost bypassed. I thought it looked old. Yeah. Yeah, so it's n over 900 years old, that is. That's good, isn't it? That's what I said. I, you can smell the centuries when you're in these places. You can smell the centuries. The Alfred Jewel Benefice. Underneath lie the remains of Mary Ann Storey, aged 13 years, also Robert Storey, aged 19, and Samuel Storey, father of the above, aged 58. Yeah, I used to know some stories when I was... So it's not like a local name. Alfred Jewel Benefice, this church must be called then. Not far from Bridgewater. I'll go outside in a minute and do the graveyard and everything. Seems to be everybody's cutting their grass today. I feel better knowing I've done three churches today. Broomfield, Kingston St Mary and Thaloxton. I nearly didn't come in here but something said no, do the three Sheila. Do the three. Right, overnight for a minute, I'll take some pictures. <laughs> 